Also, they were selling pressure, but uh, not so much. Overall market breadth, super strong. I mean, two is to one in terms of NSE advances to decline. And so many names, which we will get to in a bit, did uh, well. I'll just uh, outline a few names from the metal space. JSW Energy, JSW Steel, Hindalco, Coal India, Tara Steel. And uh, the IT uh, sector, HCL Tech, Infosys and Wipro, which did very well as well. Reema. Well, even as the large caps gave up and the rally fizzled in the last 30 minutes, the mid-cap index is ending pretty much where it was, 1.25% higher in the mid-cap index. Talking about the big gainers, Bharat Forge rallied nearly 8% on the back of strong Class A trucks at record levels for the month of September. Persistent on the back of the JP Morgan upgrade, target price at 4100 is a good 15% above the current levels. Z Entertainment, Z Media were the two stocks of the day on the back of the conditional CCI Nord for the merger with Sony. Uh, you had strength coming through in IEX as well as Macrotech developers known in Mumbai as Loda Real Estate. Uh, these stocks ended higher on the back of strong um, Q2 business updates. On the losing side, EU small finance numbers look pretty good. But the stock saw a fair amount of profit booking and it finally ended in the red. So AU Small Finance Bank slipping almost 5.5-6% from the day's high. And a weak update coming through from GCPL. And that was one of the big drags today. The stock ending goes to each consumer down close to about 4.5%. Nigel? Well, uh, you know, the problem today for the Nifty was that the Nifty Bank, that gave up a goodish bit from the high point of the day. So the Nifty Bank goes home with gains of only around 150 points odd. But that doesn't take away from the fact that you have plenty of gainers on the broader market. A few of those names should come up for you. TPL Plastic, well, that stock was locked in upper circuit. Everest as well was higher in trade today. Greenland was another stock that was buzzing around. HEG, well, that stock was flying away in trade today. HCC. Well, that stock as well did move pretty well in trade today. And CMAC as well. So the short point is from the broader markets, there were plenty of gainers actually. And a lot of those stocks did pretty well. The headline index though, a bit of a disappointing close. Though on a closing basis, at least we managed to close above that 17,300 odd mark. From tomorrow onwards, what we'll be tracking is the Nifty Bank. That's the one that's led the market higher. It's showing some bit of fatigue. Is it pausing or is it likely to see a bit of a correction? Well, time will tell on that front. But after the kind of run that we've seen, even ending high with a gain of around 50 points, well, that's something that the bulls will take. For the time being, though, we'll wrap up on this edition of Closing Bell. You don't go anywhere. Lots of guests lined up on our Thursday special. Big deal. You stay with us.